popping with the squad. How y'all living? How y'all doing? It's your boy Amari, and we back with another one, okay? And today, we part of that early link gang gang. Whole lot of gang-ish, you feel me? All right, the boy Gatsby, the seven is silent, sent me the early link to his new track. And so we're going to get into it, all right? I'm excited for this one. It's been a minute since, you know, I reacted to some gats on here. But uh, they always got love for the homie. He was uh, there for me uh, when I was, uh, as I'm coming up. So uh, much appreciated to him. Uh, drop down to the comments. Let's have a conversation if you got something to say, bro. If you got something to say, say it to me. And uh, hit that like button. Hit that comment. Hit that sub button. Hit that notification bell as well. Let's just jump into it. Let's get it. Sorry, it's an early morning out here. It's just different. Okay, okay. Gatsby, DK, Sky Diddy. These pictures they painting on some in Leonardo. Vinny Vidi Vici pumped to the head like a sleepy hollow. Ooh, okay. He's starting off hard with the punches. Okay, the Leonardo da Vinci lines, the shotgun bars. Okay. Talk to him. But this the land of discretion, so this ain't nothing new. So for the red, white, and blue, you're free to speak your truth as long as you are white and you classifying as red or blue. Oh, oh, so that's what we doing. That's what this one type of track that okay, Gats, you out here talking to him. You talking to these niggas. You talking to him. Okay. He said red, white, and blue. It's okay to speak your truth as long as you're white and you're repping red or blue. Come on now. Talk to him, Gats. And blue, you're free to speak your truth as long as you are white and you classifying as red or blue. I'm feeling ill and seeing another peaceful fight spun by Fox News to show it as if it's evil, right? I'm sick and tired of people ducking discussion, so fuck it, I'll raise a fist as I kneel with you for equal rights. Talk to him, Gats. Talk to him. See, I don't think y'all are getting it. I don't think y'all really understand what he's talking about right now. He's talking about how the media, especially especially one leaning left or right, has a tendency to take peaceful matters and escalate them into something that it's not. So when people talk about how they saw on the news that this was violent and how this movement is nothing but rioting and how, you know, such and such organization only cares about anarchy, this, that, and the other. What you're not understanding is that they're putting a spin on it to make you see it the way that they want you to see it. Those people on the ground, they may not, they're, they're, they may not be, there may be, what, 200 people out there and may not be but 10, 15 of them actually, you know, uh, escalating the situation but that's not what the media is going to tell you the media is going to tell you it's the majority why because they want to paint a picture for everybody to follow if it's not going to get people paying attention to them if it's not going to get people getting giving the reaction that they want then they're going to make it so that they can and that's the frustrating part about it is because any peaceful movement that's peaceful at its core can be dismantled literally from the inside out once you start talking about how all they're doing is perpet or is showing violence. Because at the end of the day, nobody wants their things destroyed. Nobody wants to see people hurt. So when you have these situations out here, then it takes the power away from what they're doing, what they're saying. But I appreciate people like Gatsby who's going to open their mouth and say something. Who's not going to just sit idly by. Who's going to use his position. A position of. If I dare say it. Power. Because of his skin color. Because of his following. If he's going to use that. I appreciate that he's going to use it. For, pre for preaching this message. If only begun. Your daughters and your sons, now's the moment to examine your friends. Mm. Better show some dedication, gotta need a couple leaders when the revolution begins. Uh -huh. Can we just go on living when there's people that are killing and our children are saving the end? 
Okay, yes. We're born in a world where have been hopeless, hopeless. People can make you disappear. No need for hocus pocus. People are losing focus. Police resort to violence. Rest in peace to George. Here's a moment of silence. Yeah. That's what they want is silence. So we stand up and riot. No one can keep us quiet. I seen police were riot. So it was a man just walking by. And they decided to shove him until we fell. But this shit won't fly. Cause too many lost their lives. Cause these pigs just fucking shoot. And we don't mourn the loss. Cause of color. We mourn because they're human. <laughs> Talk to him. Talk to him. This is a perspective coming from outside of the United States. DK, I think he's from the Netherlands. Correct me if I'm wrong. But that's from an outside looking in perspective. Gats gave you that. This is what we're going through here in America. This is how I feel. This is why I'm frustrated while I'm here. DK is I'm frustrated and I'm not even there with you. I see everything going on. America's in the spotlight all the time. So, yeah, we see the police violence. We see the riots. We see the protests. We see the brutality. We see all of that. We don't like that either. Why is America such a shit show? I like how these two perspectives are, are basically saying the same thing. Like, it's not okay the way things are and the way things are going. Why, like, like the song said, like, regardless of the skin color, you're still my brother, you're still my sister in the end. So why are we fighting like this? Why can't we come to a peaceful resolution? Why can't we try to understand each other? Just fucking shoot and we don't mourn the loss Cause of color we mourn because they're human mm. So we stand up and fight for equal rights For every color as we stand in unity No more fighting against each other We've only begun Tell your daughters and your sons Now's the moment to examine your friends mm. Better show some dedication Gonna need a couple leaders When the revolution begins How can we just go on living? Yeah, that's still my sister, still my brother, regardless of your color of skin. Pain is running rampant, America, we can't stand for this. They plan an execution, brutality, just the conduit. <clears throat> it's marijuana and pushing shit that is cancerous. So they can shoot a father and blame that shit on the cannabis. Talk to him. Talk to him. Talk to them. Don't nobody want to talk about how they legalize marijuana, but yet they're still using marijuana to lock people up. Don't nobody want to talk about that kind of stuff. Don't nobody want to talk about that. Don't nobody want to talk about the fact that marijuana is helping in so, in so many situations, but um, everybody out here pushing a cigarette or an e-cig or some type of vape. Nobody want to talk about that. Nobody want to talk about the good that's coming out of it. Everybody just want to switch the focus and try to make that seem bad. Come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. Don't be sheep. Pushing shit that is cancerous So they can shoot a father and blame that shit on the cannabis Marriage still a struggle if y'all don't fit in the straight ways So how the fuck can y'all look at Donald and keep a straight face? Ah. I ain't think Obama was flawless by any means But at least he looked at people as people and not machines oh. All demographic of people who need it seen But they labeled sons of bitches the second they took a knee oh. But I'm sick of it, cause ain't the white man immigrants I raise a fist when we pick at this until it's hurting they dividends they listening you right guys they ain't listening they ain't listening he just touched on so much right there he just touched on so much talking about the taking a knee movement talking about um talking about the job of our president talking about treating people as people come on gats you talking that talk right now and i'm loving it my guy i am loving it nothing but truth is coming out your mouth let these people hear it one more time one more time now, i ain't think obama was flawless by any means by any but means he looked at people as people and not machines okay Yep. But they labeled sons of bitches the second they took a knee. The second they stood for something. Man, I'm sick of it. Cause ain't the white man immigrants. I raise a fist. Oh, oh, and let's not even talk about that. 
You want to talk about how this is, everybody want to talk about make America great again. Everybody want to talk about we got to get our country back. And those same people are the ones that immigrated over here, bro. Come on now. Come on now. You're going to talk about how this is your country and how you need to take it back when that country was built on the backs of others. When you came over here and stole land, when you came over here and forced other people out and you forced your way of living on people. But um, hey, don't nobody want to hear that. Don't nobody want to hear that. Everybody just want to make America great again. The second they took a knee, man, I'm sick of it. Cause ain't the white man immigrants. I raise a fist when we pick at this until it's hurting they dividends. They ain't listening. Well, you've only begun. Tell your daughters and your sons. Now the moment to examine your friends. Oh, I love this hook. You better show some dedication. Gonna need a couple leaders when the revolution begins. How can we just go on living when there's people that are killing and our children are saving the end? Come on now. Talk to him. Talk to him. Oh, yeah, we needed that. We definitely needed that, especially going into an election day. We needed that. Shout out to Gats for this one. Shout out to Gats for this one for real. Oh, hell yeah. He did his thing. So did DK. Sky Diddy, I'm assuming that was you on the hook. You did your thing. That hook was clean as hell. I loved it. I loved the whole song. Loved the message. I, Yo, Gats, keep going, dog. We need you to keep releasing that ill music, bro. Come on now. And DK, we need you to keep releasing, man. Come on, man. All right? Drop down to the comments. If you got something to say, say it. If you got something on your mind, speak it. Use your voice, okay? Hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that notification bell as well. Stay up to date with your boy, because like you already know, we stay dropping the content. All right, let's get it. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Thanks for the support. I'm out.